All right, we on. Hey, what's going on, y'all? Sandra Slam here. Welcome back to a brand new Copic Sco vlog. Now, this is be bladed. It's a bladed one because this is on the 7th, but this is for yesterday, November 6th. And I know I did the vlog before. Kind of a ranting, venting, bitching rage, but you know, that's just how I feel. So, you know, the uh, the second person I was talking about, you know, with the gas and everything, you know, I really have nothing. I apologize to him. He's like a little brother of mine. He's got a lot of health issues and stuff. And I don't know why I fucking go off on this shit. But he tells me off. He busts my balls. You watch my videos. You know you bust my balls. He's not, fr he's not afraid to, you know, I saved my peace. But he, he, he come a long way. But then again, he's, he's been the same way. But then again, he's been made fun of back in the day. I mean, we met her in special ed, but you know, as he's gotten older, he's gotten more wiser, and he don't give a fuck. If you say some shit, he'll say shit back. He ain't afraid to speak his mind. Love you, Sparky. Also, yeah, check out, I don't know if you guys like Clone Hero, like Guitar Hero kind of stuff. He does some Clone Hero stuff. I think his, I don't, I'm sorry, Spark, if I say it wrong, Spark Shadow Tiger Gaming. Or that's his YouTube. Maybe he'll comment. Maybe he'll watch this video and comment and just put his comment there. I forgot it. Spark Shadow Tiger Gaming or whatever. He plays Clone Hero. Good motherfucker. Good fingers. If he would have met the right woman, he could fucking finger that pussy like nothing. But he's, um, he's well, he's got his own business. He don't really care about relationships and stuff. So that's my, sorry, sorry, Spark. I didn't mean to say all that shit, but yeah. Better than that, the other guy, he's my good friend. CC, but he's a fucking annoying twerp. He's been on Facebook. Oh, I'm on the game. I'm on the game. I'm on the game. I have my kid. I want to have my kid. I don't game as much. And if I do game, it'll be on the evenings. But no, you like you you like being whipped by your girlfriend. Take control of everything. Buy her a fuck. Why can't she buy her own goddamn TV? I'm sorry, God. I hate saying God thing. Why do I say that word for? It must be like an older thing or something. I don't know. I've been saying that. Uh. Other than that, though, yesterday, uh, it was like any other day, I had my kid. Um, what we do on regular Saturdays is like every like the poor man. Um, we chill out. We wake up at 8 o'clock. He's been taking his medicine. He's on some new ADHD meds or something. And also, by the way, let's get a little, let's do a little cameo. My son's on his, my turtle beaches. He's on his switch. Let's do a cameo. Here he is. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> He's playing Nintendo. That's my boy. I love him. On my heart. You know, it drives me insane. Just like I drive him insane. He's me all over again. I'm just being the parent. ADHD parent. ADHD kid. He was on some damn crap called Nephilim. This damn... Nephilim. Uh... It's like some ADHD thing. Cheek pop, ludens, have a cold still. Um, but uh, I, I and the thing is for me, I never really gave his medicine on time. And I would, I and plus I lost a damn little cup thing. And he only had to take like 0.5 milliliter or something like that, or, or whatever teaspoon. Now he's taking a pill form. I was the same way. I was his same when I was his age. It was the same damn thing. Um, but no, we every Saturday I spend time with my mom. People, oh, you sucking your mom's tit. My dad says that too. Steve, I love you, dad, but you're an asshole. Yeah, suck on the mom's tit, or whatever. Hanging out my mom. Why don't you hang up us? Why don't we have a whole family gathering going to go in the grocery store? No, he rather be he's old school work mentality. Every day, like Saturday, we go at uh, ten o'clock or like right now, it's ten thirteen, ten thirty, eleven ish. So we usually go to my parents' house every Saturdays and go there. I don't like staying here all damn day. He's on the damn game of screen time all damn day. And I, I'm not, I know. His mother bitches me at it. I just give in. Because I'm a viewer gamer myself. But the thing is, well, I'm, a, I'm on my phone all the damn time. Which my son busts my balls too. You're on the game all the time. He's like, no, not the game. I'm on the phone most all the time. Just I have it all around me. I have my headphones on. You know, I have always listening up. I have my pacifier. So, so I have on. But, um, and, but my dad, what does he do? He goes to the damn bar. He wakes up and goes to the bar. Saturdays. Oh, everybody loves him at the bar. He's a made man at the bar. 
They look at my ID. Oh, Sam Elliott, is your dad Steve Elliott? Yep, that's my dad. And they teach, see, they talk, the bartenders look at these women and guys. See that guy over there? That's Steve's son. Yeah. Oh, he's such a good man. He talks about his son and his grandson and all that. Yeah, but when he goes home, he's up his ass. Up his ass on the recliner watching the damn westerns and crap. Same old shit. But oh well. I love him. But then again, oh well. I tell him I love him every day I see him. You know? He was bitching and whining because last year, because I missed his 60th birthday. I didn't tell him happy birthday. Oh, good God. But what I do, his birthday's coming up on the 15th next month. And what I do every year, I, I buy him a $16 ribeye steak at Aldi. Or whatever I can get. I'll give him a, here you go, happy birthday. Here's a big ass steak for you, Dad. Love you too. Back in the 90s, we used to, when Hills was around, old department store, they used to have this credit, this credit, this card, this card make, you can make a birthday card stuff. I remember, I still remember, we made a Chicago Bulls card for him. Those were awesome, making those cards back in Hills. Good memories. Um, but other than that, no, we go, we chill, and then we go to the grocery store. My son hates it, but we had the switch with him. We have two, well, sometimes we have two extra carts, one cart for him just to sit down. Next time, though, I'm not bringing the damn thing. I don't give a damn. He tries to get his way all the time. Every time he leaves his mom's, he tells his mom, I'll be good, I'll be good. But he tries to get his way because his mom's more intimidating. God, yeah. Or something. But we're going to try it again. But that's be in a week and a half because I'm not going to see him till a week and a half. Um, but yeah, I went to the store. I got out of Walmart. i uh, been looking for some ideas for my girlfriend Heather for Christmas. My son for Christmas. Uh, my mother, which I don't know what I'm going to get my mom and my dad this year. Or my sister. <clears throat> Um, now my sister is going to be turning 23? Let's say I'm 31. 31, 30, 29, 20, 27, 26, 23, 24? 22, 20. I, I don't know my damn sister's age. We're eight, I was eight when she was born. So I'm 31, 30, 29, 28, 27, 24. I don't know, but my birth, my sister's birthday is coming up. My mom got her a gift. It's pretty damn awesome. She's gonna like that gift. Um, but no, we had a good time at Walmart, like always, yada yada. And then we go to Aldi, which Ronnie had a temper tantrum. Cause he, oh, he didn't like going grocery shopping. So what he did, he we got him to get him to go inside, and he he was laying underneath the car with his coat over his head. Don't talk to me. Well, because his Nintendo died, too. And then his mom likes to micromanage me all the time. I don't really give a damn what she... she ha, When she has him, that's him. Yeah, I understand. He, he takes his meds, fine. But I just... I get really... Under, she's like a female. She's basically me as a female. We have so many... Like, um... Similarities, in a way. Like, you know, bitchy, ranty... Don't give a fuckness, but then again, we do care. But the thing is, though, you know, she stays up late because she waits for her man to get out of work. And here's the thing I told my girlfriend, Heather. I said, I said, baby, if I worked and I got home by midnight and say we have a kid ourselves, which I'm hoping one day we will. Hopefully my dick can work. But um, I told her, I don't expect you to be awake. I mean, when I get in the bedroom and you're in bed laying down, there you go. Okay, what do you want? There's a new update on Funky Friday. What? There's a new update. There's a new update on this Funky Friday. This kid with Funky Friday. Friday Night Funkin'. It's on Roblox. They have an We're update. We're not allowed to play Roblox. Oh, I'm making a video. Play your game. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna go play it. I'm gonna go play your game now. Yeah. There you go. Ooh, another cameo from my son. Friday Night Funkin'. He's not allowed to play Roblox. I mean, I don't care, but his mom doesn't want to play Roblox. He's been playing Roblox since he's like three years old. 
or whatever. If you see my YouTube, if you put Santa Slam Gaming, you'll see videos of him playing when he was younger, when he was little. Now, I don't care. You're not playing. I'm not arguing with you. If Roblox was on the Nintendo, yeah, I'll go at it, but it's not on there. I wish it was. But, um... <laughs> I swear, he acts like his mom. He is just like his mother. I don't care. You're the same, too. You have, you have attitudes as well. You're just like me. I swear. He gets mad, but he don't get his way. I was the same damn way. Uh, but I love that. I love him so much. Um, but we had a good time. But it mean in plus, but the things I got, my girlfriend came on by, got to hang out with her, and I got her sick. Well, we all both got sick. We went to Indian Beach last week, which I still have videos I haven't uploaded yet. I still have videos that I didn't upload with Ronnie the last time we took him. So I got to get those uploaded soon, sometime after this. Um, but other than that, uh, but. And we both have allergies. My throat hurts because I'm a I'm a great I'm an awesome kung linguist. I know how to sue my lady. Sorry TMI, but these are my videos. Uh, but yeah, um, but you know, and then also about Call of Duty, by the way. Well, actually, no, we'll go back to hold on a minute. We'll do that last. So we get to watch Dennis the Menace. I never get to watch it. Is met with my girlfriend and my son, and uh, I never, I've always seen it. it's with Walter Matto, and I know the guy. Also, Christopher Woods in it, Switchblade Sam. Also, I forgot there's another guy in there from Home Alone. He's the one, the, one of Macaulay Culkin's Kevin McAllister's cousins, the fat so with the spiders and shit. You know what I'm talking about? I barely watched it. I was on my laptop, but I was in the room with them. But at the same, but after that, um, I. Take her. We take her home. I usually take her home around nine o'clock ish. Um, and we uh, we're going for some car issues. My dad's car is a is in the shits. It's a Cabot. I think it's an 08, but it's drivable more. I I I, I have no have no problems. It always happens with them driving, but when I drive it, it's fine as can be. Then we have the Impala, <coughs> the the 06 Impala. Which is my grandpa's old car, which he's probably rolling his grave. And then you have the um, the 1998 Escort, which we got from my grandpa's best friend slash salesman, Stan Enix. I can't say his last name, but we got that in 2010. This 1998 little Escort, which was supposed to be my car, but then something happened. Why do you keep coming here and ruining my video? Sorry, guys. My son had a temper tantrum. So I just send him up to his room. He's mad because he don't get his way. Just like me, how I was. But where was I? No, we, the escort. Well, the Impala, we put, my mom's put money, 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 or a charge, 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 my parents. And then I get looked at because I'm the free loader taker. My dad calls me all the time. Next month, hopefully, like I said, miners hope I get this job, hopefully. <coughs> well, the escort has a smoking exhaust problem from hell. I call it the cancer car. It smells terrible. Oh, and now the Impala is having some kind of smoky leak. I don't know what it is. It's It looks scary. But, so we, I went to my parents' house. My mom asked me, if, I asked my mom if I can use the car and use the white car. We used it earlier yesterday. Take Heather and my son and we get to Gas City and then the car dies. It overheats. I was pissed. I'm stressed out. And if car, I'm sorry. I'm a retired when it comes to cars. I don't really care. I just like to drive them. I don't have the, like the, the mine or what the, the skills for cars. Even when a person tells me, oh, this is what I need to do. I just have to pay more money just to have someone else do it for me. Um, but this car dies. I'm luckily that my I, I get to push the car out a little way to get out of the road. Um, some jackass was there for 10 seconds but left. Dumb bitch. Um, I push it out. Uh, call my mom. My mom came. Did my dad come? No. 
But we end up, uh, she helped me. We end up uh, leaving the car there. We end up taking Heather back home. And then we came back to the car. And then it, it was, was smoking, smoking the, the worst it's ever been. So, but, yeah. Um, we, and then I made a video, which I'll, I'll, I'll upload, of just a little of just driving and stopping three, four times where it was because it was it kept overheating. It's depressing. And I wish I just pray to hope we would not get we would get some good luck because I don't know how I'm going to be. I might have to go to work, go on the, the city bus or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might have to walk or ride my bike, but it, it just I hope to man up one day. I mean, I still I can man up, but I just I'm not that full capacity. Other than that, we got we finally got home. And we'll, we'll we'll finish off here. I got to put, I got it, it was the second day of uh, no the third day of well of evening of Call of Duty Vanguard. My buddy Ty, which I said he don't really play the games much, he downloaded it, and me and him were having probably one. I mean we we sucked a little bit, but we had a good time. He actually enjoys a little bit of it, and we're having a damn good blast. But I know coming up. Uh, his Jurassic World's coming up. And I told him, Here's he, I'm one of those little bitchy people. Oh, come on, play the game. I don't care. I'll chat with him. And he's going to get the new Jurassic World game. Evolution. He likes that game. So that's cool. And I said, well, you know, it's fine. We, we, we still game chat or, or party chat. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. So, but we had a good damn time. I'm probably going to upload that uh, gameplay, that little playthrough as well. It's an hour long. I mean, I know I don't think people watch it. I mean, people can skip through. But it was awesome. Um, and I had a couple good games. I had a fucking free for all. The first, and this is what pisses me off. I had a free for all game, the first ever free for all game. And I look at the game stats of my like um, regression or whatever, just my stats I've done, and I'm a one point fifteen, or I'm not the best. I, I suck. But the free for all, I had, I was first place on free for all. Which I could I could not believe, and guess what? The stats didn't fucking say. I don't know how that was, but it pissed me off. But I'm gonna try to enjoy it more. Um, I should have just got the regular game, but I spent too damn much. But oh well, we go on from there. We learn from our mistakes. I do want to get Battlefield, but then again, but, and, but also this is the first Call of Duty where it's shits and giggles. I don't really care about my KD as much. I mean, I still want to meet new people. But I'm really fucking shy, and then I'm more angry. And when I say, come on, where's the call-outs? And everybody's, oh, where, where, where? Well, fuck you, too. But, yeah. Better than that, uh, but, we're, uh, but that was a better night than before. But, yeah. So, but I'm STS. I thank you guys, to whoever watches my vlogs, if you like, if you entertain by my rants and or my movie reviews, which I need to do some movie reviews soon. I need to get that damn. I need to get, watch Vigilante because I want to get. I want to watch some Vigilante films. Uh, that's, I said that's gonna be the next movie I want to watch is Vigilante and then Death Wish Three. So I'm a big, huge Paul Kersey fan, aka Charles Bronson. I watched Charles Bronson Death Wish when I watched Death Wish Three when I was younger, and I've seen some rapes and killing uh, as a young gauge, like ten years old, probably like wow. Um, but yeah. Uh, but if you like my videos, make, make sure to subscribe. Give me a comment. Say hi or say, hey, man, what's going on? You know, or, but um, I don't know. I'm going to get the hell out of here. I'm STS. Thank you for watching this Copen Scope vlog. And I'll probably be on later tonight. So I'll be doing a vlog probably. Or maybe another belated one. So peace.